You know, I just want to tell you, I'm with my friend here, Governor Peter Obi. Um, we're in DC. Uh, we came all in for uh, the national prayer breakfast. But you see, I listen to this man. I listen to Governor Peter Obi. And, you know, ex Governor Peter Obi, the, the plans, the ideas, you know, this man raised the bar of leadership in Nigeria. He raised the bar of leadership in Nigeria. Since he left office, can you believe that this man does not take anything, not even like a, a, a penny from the Anambra State government? And while he was there, you know, he was a man that built up an number state. You know, a number state used to be almost educationally disadvantaged. And then in less than two years, he brought them to be number one. He left their, that state with a reserve. Look, you know, we need people like this. I'm so proud of Governor Obi. I, I listened to him today and, you know, I was taught, like, do we have fellows like this in Nigeria? I'm very proud of this man. Look at everything that he has touched. He made money for himself in the private sector. He made money for an ambassador in, 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 in government. An ambassador doesn't borrow money. Are you aware of that? These bailout funds that uh, the current administration is giving states, I mean, he left enough for an ambassador. I'm very proud of this man. You know, Governor Bipi, just say something to my followers, to my fans. Well, thank you, all of you. All I'm saying is that we have no other country except Nigeria. We must work hard to build it. We must build it. It's our country. We cannot be with our children and those coming after us, anarchy, will defeat them a better country. Now you heard it. God bless you. Talk to you guys later.